guys, today I've got another module here I'm going to show you guys. Uh, it's called X-Blast Tools. It's right there. Obviously, you can go to Downloads and Exposed and uh, download the module, activate it, reboot your device, and you'll have this module. All these uh, modules also get installed, installed, I should say, into your app drawer right here, X-Blast Tools, and you can open them up. Now, X-Blast Tours is just filled and filled and filled with cool custom tweaks and modifications. I'm going to show you guys some of them, not all of them, just because there is so many. But definitely check this thing out for yourself. It does do a lot of cool stuff. So we'll just show you a couple of them. One of them right here is under Miscellaneous. And you go to Advanced Power Menu and turn it on and check all of these things. And what that does is when you hold the power button... There you go. So now you have all these options for screenshots, screen records, reboot. You can also have soft boot, reboot, reboot recovery, fast reboot, all these different things. Very, very nice. Um, I like that feature a lot here in miscellaneous. Um, that's one that I've already enabled. That's why I'm showing it to you. There's also like carrier labels. You can adjust this, come in here and change these. You know, click on it, change it. Right now it's X Blast. And what that actually adjusts is this screen right here. Right there at the bottom it says X Blast. So that's something that is obviously different in there as well. Um, another thing I wanted to show you was navigation bar. And you can see my um, back home and menu look a little different. And basically the reason why is you go to soft key and you pick what kind you want. There's stock right there. I'm on Zenith. I think that's how you spell it. Um, pixel text looks pretty cool. Definitely some different things you can change there for buttons. Um, there's tons of also way more modifications you can do in each of these sections that I'm showing you. I'm just kind of giving you a kind of a basics uh, overview of the application. This is kind of neat right here. You can turn this on. This is called a circuit launcher. And once you turn it on here, you activate it right there. It gives you this little green little bar on the side. And you can swipe over to it and it opens this up and you can scroll through your applications so I like that it shows you this green in here it kind of gives you an indication of how this this uh, circle app launcher is going to function for you um, there's a bunch of settings in here of adjusting things if you want to do that but I'll just go home really quick you can see that goes away and then if you just swipe over you know there you go there's your launcher for launching different applications from right here so that is very very cool definitely uh, liking that feature for sure um, here you go you can see it's still in here but you can also turn it back off and you can actually turn on app bar which is the same kind of concept it's just a little different you can see you can scroll over and you can see all this stuff we'll change the transparency down there you go and you can pick applications here you can hide the icon labels or enable them here they're enabled um, and it's the same kind of setup. So very, very nice, very easy to put an app bar launcher on the side, which is very cool. And you can see here you got stuff like quiet hours um, for turning off notifications, full screen caller ID stuff here in your phone tweaks, um, just, just tons and tons of different uh, customizations, volume button tweaks, and all this kind of stuff. Build prop tweaks. You want to back up your build prop first, then you can adjust some of these if you want to. Um, like I said, it's just this thing's just loaded. One of the things I'm going to kind of point out to you guys is that this doesn't. Whenever you're adjusting things, um, like status bar or something like that, you're adding something, you're changing a color, um, you know, all that kind of stuff. Then you definitely want to um, adjust it. Do your adjustments. Then go ahead and do a reboot. You know, go in here, hit reboot, reboot your device, and then all those adjustments will take effect on your device. Um, they don't, some of them do it automatically um, while you're in the application right here. Like you could see with the circle app launcher or the app bar, that stuff is automatic. It's done right on the fly, but a lot of the tweaks in here are done after reboot. So um, definitely play around with it. Very, very cool. I'm liking it. I'm going to be playing with it some more, learn some more on it, but it just does pretty much everything you want to mod it 
this is the exposed module for you so you go guys that's going to be my quick overview here of x blast tools hope you guys like it uh, stay tuned for more videos like this and we'll catch you guys next time root junkie out